This local sports report is presented by the Fence and Deck Experts, a proud supporter of the Wilmot Wild. Check out the Fence and Deck Experts for professional work and quality service. They make your backyard an extension of your living space, installing custom decks with pressure-treated or composite wood with a glass railing. They also offer a variety of fence options, from wood to vinyl to chain link. Call now to get a quote at 519-804-3325. That's 519-804-DECK. Thursday night, Junior C Lacrosse from the Center Wellington Sportsplex in Fergus. The Fergus Thistles playing host to the Wilmot Wild. Early in the first, the Wild on the attack. Ethan Warden feeds Travis Rebot. Travis steps in and fires a cannon into the net. And Wilmot have the first goal of the night. Only seconds later, Fergus respond with some offense of their own. Curtis Dietrich and Brock Reinhardt combined for Fergus's first goal of the night, and it's 1-1. Minutes later, Thistle's power play now. John James Levine fakes a pass and shoots, and he gets Fergus the 2-1 lead. Wilmont back the other way looking to equalize. Here's Ethan Warden winning himself some space and getting the feed from Travis Rebot coming in. He finishes it, tying the game up at 2. Jumping to the second now, 3-2 Fergus. The Wild pressing on the power play deep in Thistle territory. Cole Main picks it up on the side of the net and finds Travis Rebot back door. Travis slams it home. He's got his second of the game, and now we're square at three. Seconds later, here's the Wild again off the transition. Travis Rebot feeds the full speed Kyler Morgan, who slots it in top shelf on the run. And the Wild keep the speed up. Only a minute later, here's Blake Forrester with a deep pass to Alex French. Alex isn't alone, and he converts on the chance, putting Wilmot up five to three. Later, here's Cole Doherty chasing after a loose ball. Aiden Kelly out of his net collects the ball, but here comes Cole with a big hit running over the wild netminder. Multiple wild players not impressed, and we see some fireworks after the whistle as both teams get into it. Moments later, James Mackey and Travis Rebot killing a penalty deep in Fergus territory. Mackey fights for a pass to Rebot, who's left alone out front, and Travis scores a shorty and claims his hat trick bringing the score to 6-3, Wild. Fergus back the other way on the power play, looking to turn the game's momentum around. JJ Swanston fakes a pass and rips one in the net, cutting the lead to two. And the Thistles wouldn't stop there. John James Levine with a deep shot, bringing Fergus within one. The Thistles still on the power play, looking to tie this one up. Here's Keegan Detweiler back door with a diving finish, rounding out the three-goal power play surge from Fergus. The Thistles scoring three goals in two minutes and tying the game at six. Back to the highlights in a minute, but first a reminder that this video is presented by Fence and Deck Experts, a proud supporter of the Wilmont Wild. For professional work and quality service, call 519-804-DECK. Jumping back into the second, here's Ethan Warden on the power play. He winds up and blasts one, reclaiming the Wild's lead. 30 seconds later, here's Kyler Morgan driving to the net. He feeds Eric Snyder back door, and Snyder makes no mistake putting this one away. Lane the second now, 8-6 Wild. Chase Forsyth fires through the defense, and he scores, so it's 9-6 Wild heading into the third. Early in the third now, Fergus looking to mount another comeback. Here's John James Levine driving the net. He gets taken out mid-shot, but he won't be denied as he claims his hat trick, cutting the lead to two. Midway through the third now, Fergus power play. Keegan Detweiler's shot from the top of the circle is a beauty shelfer, and the Thistles are within one. And only 30 seconds later, they'd find the equalizer. Curtis Dietrich with a long bomb buries it, tying the game up at nine. Fergus riding high on some late momentum, keep pressing. Carter Coffey fighting his way in front, and he's got the go-ahead goal. Minutes later, the Thistles keep coming. Brock Reinhardt turns on the Jets, cuts in, and brings it home. Fergus now up 11-9 after five unanswered goals. Late in the third now, Fergus power play. Carter Coffey finds Keegan Detweiler back door, and Detweiler's got another. A scoring frenzy in Fergus Thursday night as the Fergus Thistles find their footing in the third and take down the Wilmot Wild by a final score of 13-10. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.